Hey, what is up, guys? Johnny here. Today, we'll look at the best snipers in the game the true Patriot Legendary Sniper and the best and skiller Epic Sniper. Let's look at the stats first. The best and skillers got 1066 as base damage, while the true Patriots got 1230. It's a lot more, but everything else goes to the best and skiller. It's got higher fire rate, better accuracy, it's got longer range. But most of all, it's got one more bullet in the clip. The True Patriot is a legendary sniper, so it's got four more perks. If you compare the perks, they both have an extra 6% fire rate. They both have 8% accuracy. And they both have extra damage. The Besson's got an extra 10% while the true Patriots got only 6% extra damage. So that will reduce the difference a little bit. The thing that's very good on the Besson though is the 15% extra crit damage. The true Patriot does not have a crit damage perk. We will look at these two snipers in action in the same situation. It's a stationary boss fight again. We want to see how much damage these snipers can deal in 10 seconds because 10 seconds is the duration of the supercharger active skill. So in this first clip right here, we see uh, the same clip I've shown you guys in my previous video about the OG Moneymaker, but we saw that the Besson's Killer can shoot 9 bullets in this 10 second duration and he deals 4505 damage on the crit. This next clip here shows the true Patriot shooting at the same stationary boss. You see it can deal 5097 on the crit but it shoots much slower it will only shoot is six bullets before the reload then one more after the reload then the supercharger is gone so that's only seven bullets total let's do the math so we said the best in killer will shoot nine bullets each crit if you hit all crits will deal 4505 so that will be a total of 40,545 total damage in the 10 second duration of the supercharger what about the true Patriot now? We said the Patriot will deal 5097 on the crit with the exact same gear I was using on the Besson video, but it will only shoot seven bullets instead of nine. That is a total of 35,679. So in the same situation, the Besson's killer would actually deal 5,000 more damage on the boss. So overall, the Besson's killer seems to be a better choice in this specific scenario, will, will you be speed farming dungeons, trying to do as much damage in the short period of time, try to get the boss kill as fast as possible. But in real life, it's not always that. And you would know that you don't always hit your crits. And the Besson shines where you hit your crits because of the 15% extra damage on the crits. So if you don't always hit your crits, the difference would not be as big. So it would be very, very close you compare the actual total damage on the Besson and on the True Patriot. One thing I really like though is the fact that the Besson's got one more bullet in the clip and also it can carry a lot more ammo. The maximum on the Patriot would be 22-23 while this one right here would carry 34-35. So that's a pretty big difference if you run a dungeon and you have a chance to pick up lots of ammo on the ground. You can deal a lot more damage. But it really depends on your playstyle. If you run around, you look for good targets, you shoot bullets, the fire rate really doesn't matter. So at this point, it's very close between both, depending really on your playstyle and what game modes you play. If you play 1v1 or if you play Ascendancy, maybe you're gonna feel more comfortable having one more bullet in the clip and being able to shoot quicker. So it's very personal. One thing I wanna show you guys is to check this out. This is a crit in the back. 2475 now this is a head crit on a different enemy uh 2751 now check again this is gonna be the exact same enemy but aiming down sight 2475 again and this dude right here same thing aiming down sight to the head 2751 again that brings you to think again the iron sight damage on the true patriot is actually not working not just on the crit because i thought maybe the uh, iron sight just work on non-crit damage and the crit is not affected by the extra damage but that's not true because i did test with uh, other auto rifles and the uh, extra iron sight damage works on the crit also so 
you want to think is it just the iron side damage that's not working or or all the perks are broken on these legendaries like how can you know if the six percent reload speed or the eight percent accuracy is actually working would you even notice you could compare two clips of uh, reloading your your uh, rifle before the uh, perk is unlocked and then watch another clip with the extra six percent reload and compare would you even notice a six percent difference what about the eight percent accuracy would you notice so i don't know guys maybe all these perks are broken and we don't even know uh probably we wouldn't see the difference but it could make a difference on the extra base damage or extra iron sight damage patriots got one besson does not have one so it could make a bigger difference in total anyways guys that's gonna be it for now hope you guys enjoyed this little video but i'm gonna end it and not say which one is better because they are very close but in my case which is uh dungeon farming i'll definitely go with the best since killer now because i know what i want to do with my weapon you know but if you play pvp if you play arena even i don't think there's a very big difference between both overall it really is personal depends on your play style and your personal preference so guys hope you enjoyed this video if you did please hit the like Make sure you subscribe to the channel, turn on your notifications, watch my other videos. I'll be back soon. Take care, guys.